Hello, my name is Joshua Ott with Crazewell. In this video, I will be demonstrating the use of the Safe Purge air mover. We are set up for an abandonment on a one way feed. So the direction of flow is coming from here to there. Uh, first off, this end cap right here, this represents a stopping device of some type, either a, a valve or a stopple. We have two short stops. These both would be an in-service weld. These short stops would be put down, put on the pipeline. This short stop here is at the as is at the end, the, which would be the dead end. This one here is is your purging stack is where you would purge and depressurize. This two-inch coupling here represents a two-inch gate valve. So at any time during this operation, with the safe purge air mover attached, you can still have a positive shut off. If something goes wrong, you can always shut down at your gate valve. Here we have our safe purge air mover that is screwed into the gate valve. And if you can see, we have a grounding wire that's attached to the, the tool. In this demonstration, it's hooked to this jack stand representing being attached to a grounding rod. And above the tool, we, we have screwed on a, a purging stack. Crazeweld offers a three-piece, 10-foot-long aluminum purging stack. Here, I just have one piece attached. The 10-foot the purging stack that we offer is to have your necessary above-ground height per company standard. Here, we are connected with a three-quarter-inch air line that runs from a towable air compressor. We'll be running at 105 PSI. I'd also like to, to point out this black line on the pipe represents your proposed cut line. So when the line is depressurized, we run the tool, which purges out any residual gas before we make any cuts. This is where a cut would be made and the rest of that pipeline would be abandoned. This is your inlet. Air is gonna be coming in. It's gonna be traveling down this way and it's gonna be flowing out the, the purging device and the purging stack. To show the operation of purging residual gas from the pipeline, I'm going to fill the, the demonstration piece with smoke. It's this, this whole line is going to be filled. And then I'm going to add inlet air to the tool. And it's going to create the venturi flow on the bottom side of the tool. And it'll draw the smoke through the tool and the purging stack.